Welcome to another installment of West Virginia Smoking, Grilling, and Outdoors. Today, I'm going to show you how to clean off your Blackstone griddle after you've had a cook. The process is really simple, and I use the same process every single time, and it gets it done. So let's get started. All you need for this is a couple squeeze bottles full of water and canola oil. You need a set of tongs, some paper towels, and your scraper. You start with your grill on and hot, and then you grab your squeeze bottle and douse it down with some water. Let the water steam for a little while to loosen up some of that debris. Next, take your scraper and keep a smooth, even pressure on it, but keep it gentle as not to loosen up any of your seasoning, but you want to remove all the food debris. Repeat the water and scraping process as many times as you need until the debris is gone. Next, grab your paper towels and your set of tongs and dry the area. Now it's time to re-season. So you grab yourself another clean paper towel and then you add your canola oil. Once again, about two to three tablespoons is plenty. Make sure you coat the entire area, including the sides and the back of the sides, so your griddle is nicely seasoned. Just to re-season, and I like to do this process twice. That way it keeps your seasoning nice and smooth. If you see any streaks in your oil while you're doing this process, grab another clean paper towel and just wipe it off. Now you just let your griddle smoke until the smoke stops, which takes about 15 to 20 minutes, and then you just repeat the seasoning process one more time. And now you're ready for your next cook. So get to griddling, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'll see you on the next one.